two holes drilled here and countersunk for some lag bolts to go down through this little overlap in to this beam right here. Just marking that out. I'm gonna roll this over. Get that out of the way. And lay it out again on this side. Okay, so we have the profile all cut out. This is ready to, to put up. Just taking my chisel and kind of cleaning that up. Now I have a hole here that I can use as a pilot to drill my half inch hole all the way through. And I'll make a mark there at 36 inches. I have to make a silky pass here. We'll just see.
click, click. This inside of the beam is actually our control. I've got my little catch pieces there and I can just bring that up to where it just touches the beam on the inside of the beam. And I'm taking my pencil and I'm just making a little bitty mark there. Then I can just lay this right over and we drop it square and I can finish my mark. Now I can take this one by off. Just anything to push up right there about where your hand is because this there it went there it went you're under now
Okay, I'm gonna give this block back to you. <laughs> this room's not gonna be heated, but I'm gonna put some Tyvek on there to kind of cut some air off. I went ahead and floored in between the rails so that we can get across the floor. I've left the room that I need right here for the head to roll up and not be rubbing against anything. And also put in a couple of steps here so we can get up and down and cross. <laughs> I think it'll work. 